Hi Capricorn, this is Renee Michelle and welcome to my YouTube channel, Chronicles of a Hoodoo Spiritualist. Welcome everybody, welcome to the new subscribers. Thank you, thank you, thank you for joining. Um, thank you for the love and support and you guys know what I'm talking about. Thank you so much. Um, I will be contacting to you, those of you who donated, personally myself. Just give me a little time and trying to rest up so that I can give you good videos with good energy. Um, spiritual awareness. Wow. We're starting another one. I just posted it. Um, emotional and mental abuse. Check it out. I'm always scratching my eyeball. I don't know what that is. Um, oh, if you would like to contact me, the information is down below, of course. Um, you can email me. Um, the price of the the personal reading is, is going up. I'll let you guys know what that's going to be. Well, when you contact me, I'll tell you. Um, also, um, what else? Capricorn. Wow. <laughs> this is your weekly reading for January 31st to... January 31st, 1st, 2nd, 3rd, 4th, 5th, to January 6th, I mean February 6th, so it's January 31st to February 6th, 2016. All right, Capricorn, let's see what you got. Thank you so much for the support, really, guys, it's meant a lot, thank you. A whole lot. to stop they told me to take out my necklace my leaky leaky e-l-e-k-e-s leaky Did you see it? I did. The judgment card is the underlying of this week. The feeling that's going on. And what it is, is about assessment. It's about picking and choosing the things, the situations, and the people that no longer serve you. Right? So this week, you are really going, going through the, the catalog of folks and recognizing that there are people that just don't belong. You have to remove them. Block their number. Block their Facebook. Let them go. I was gonna go somewhere else and they told me no, okay? So the feeling coming into this week. I have a candle here, it's a little hot. Let me move this in just a little bit.
Some of you are giving to charity, are thinking about giving into charity or giving to the church. See, this is money coming in for you, right? But she's facing the hair farm, which has to do with organized religion, organized religion, education, right? So if you get money coming in, you might be thinking about, okay, I can go back to school with this money, right? Yeah, because the money is not even staying in the pocket from what I see. Because see, her, the coins, they, they fall in. I'm looking at the ones that are on the outside. So the money is going out. About improving yourself. Towards improving yourself. Maybe you can decide to go to a therapist. Improving mind, body, and spirit. So some of you might be joining the gym with some money. But definitely I feel like it's about self-improvement. So going into this week, you're like, I got to get better. I got to do what I have to do to get better. So the, the judgment card, which is the underlining of the reading about you making an assessment of people is part of you getting better, increasing your spirit. Removing those people that no, 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 no longer serve you, right? So then also you have... The, 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 this money coming in, you said to yourself, you know what, I, I really need to do use this towards myself, which is a very, very good thing, Capricorn, very good thing. Expanding my mind and my, my growth. Reconnecting with my God. Finding some way of spiritual balance. Yoga, 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 yoga. Getting in touch with myself. Spending money and time on me, spas, spas. They show me spas, spas, spas. Just taking a break, taking it easy. Using using some money to to to, to relax yourself. For self reflection, for a time out. But mostly for spiritual growth. I'm happy. Good, good, good. Tell you, I'm a, two inches from pulling this out. Let me put that up in here. <laughs> so beginning of the week, sun Sunday through Tuesday, Tuesday maybe. Something is ending. Maybe it's the old you and the way you used to live and how you used to do things is changing. But there's a start to new here because there's something that you know. I'm cutting these people out. I'm moving on. I'm starting anew with myself. That's what they give me the feeling. Like, you're starting anew with myself. I got to get, you know, balance in myself. I got to move the energy to me instead of focusing on all these people and their negative vibe and their negative energy and their negative talk. Some of the people around you don't even have a positive thing to say. It's like, come on, really? You hate to pick up the phone, so why pick it up? So starting a new hunt, brand new, right? This is a big deal. It's a major arcana card. So it's the death card, but it's also it's the rebirth card. So something about the past is ending, and you're starting anew with yourself. This is all about you and your spiritual and your personal growth, right? Towards the middle of the week, they just, these, suckers, these, these, these people are trying to get back in. All righty, y'all ready? <laughs> like damn I just stopped talking to you three days ago <laughs> what's your problem you ain't got nothing else to do but mess with me yes that's all they got to do so stand your ground that's what this card is about standing your ground saying look I need my personal space I need my time you give them enough time they'll find somebody else to bother Somebody else to be around, something else to do. You're standing your ground on something. I don't think this is an argument. I think this all has to do with you, Capricorn. I'm really focused on you and changing you as a person. And like I said, these people are trying to convince you that, oh, you don't need personal time right now. You don't need this personal space. And you saying, back up. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Who the fuck are you?
You can't let these people in. You can't let them back in. If you kicking them out the door, they're going to stand at the door like, what you doing? Trying to see in the crack? <laughs> Don't even open the door. Don't even open the door. Capricorn, come on. So by the end of the week, everybody loves you. Girl, you don't mean that. Come on. you For real, you don't my friend. You know I love you. You know the real deal. So this is an offer in love. This is a page of, 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 these are immature people. Page of cups. At the end of the week, it's all about I love you. You know you don't want me to let to let me go. You know me and you is you my girl. I'm your girl. Come on, girl. Yo, you know you my dude. You know what's up. Oh. You selfish. Leave me alone. That's this is a voice message. I hope you okay. Hope everything's all right. By the way, you know my man did with that thing again. It's enough. It's enough, Capricorn. It's enough. So by the end of the week, you taking on you taking on 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 the hair font role of going in and learning and growing in oneself and educating oneself in all things possible to increase your self worth and self growth. And when you've learned enough, you see that light; it will shine you to where you want to go. That lantern will. So don't worry. Take that time out to yourself. Close all doors. You see. You're going to stop hanging out with friends because that's what the Three of Cups is about. Upright, that's partying and everything like that. Right? I'm going to stop hanging out with you and then I'm going to turn my back on you. <laughs> Woo! There's some people leaving Capricorn's life this week. I'm going to stop hanging out with you because this is hanging out, partying, drinking, having a good time. So, no, I'm not going to do that. And then you going on with the half fun, so you turned your back looking around all together to increase your self worth and your self growth. To learn more about you and be okay with self. Wow, Capricorn, go ahead. Go ahead! Extraordinary. I'm gonna name myself. I'll see you next week, guys. Oh, late, late, late on next week for spiritual awareness. Thanks again. You know what for. Love you and stay blessed.